And these illegal alien crimes are happening as far away from the border as Wisconsin. Right here in small town Wisconsin, a member of a savage Venezuela gang was arrested for sexually assaulting a woman and attacking viciously a child. He's charged with suffocation, child abuse, sexual assault, and many other things. I will get these monster criminals out of Wisconsin. I will get them out of our country. Joining me now, Republican Eric Hovde. He's running to unseat Democrat incumbent Senator Tammy Baldwin in Wisconsin. Tight race there, Eric. Now, Trump was talking about 26-year-old Alejandro Jose Coronel Zarate, a suspected member of the Trendra Argua uh, gang. How worried are people in Wisconsin? That's just one of the crimes that have, has been documented. Look, Laura, every state is a border state, and we've had multiple cases of crime all over our state. Uh, you're just citing that case. We had a father of several young children who was killed in a drunk driving accident. We had a 12-year-old girl that was kidnapped. Fortunately, she got away. We had an illegal immigrant kill his own two children here about a month ago. So this crime issue is touching every state. And you look, they, they put 1,000 people into a small town called Whitewater. Uh, turn the city budget upside down, access to housing, health care. There's so many problematic layers to uh, this open border. And, and they're killing our young people with fentanyl. Uh, it's a poison created in China, sent to the drug cartels and brought up. We lost 108,000 young Americans last year. And, you know, Wisconsin has had their fair share of losses, sadly. Now, Newsweek had a headline after Trump's comments that we just played about that Wisconsin attack. And it said, suspected Venezuelan gang member arrest gives Trump fodder in Wisconsin. Eric, you can see the kind of very dismissive attitude. Oh, it's just fodder. It's almost like it's not a human being. Nor are the 300,000 that Will just mentioned who went missing, children missing, who didn't get mentioned, I don't believe, unless I forgot, at the, at the debate. Missing kids. Look, they've created a humanitarian crisis. Uh, look, I have a foundation that has been fighting against sex trafficking in this country for over a decade. Uh, and I have homes around the world, Hovde homes that rescue children from uh, the sex trafficking business, slavery, abandonment. And I can sadly tell you, a lot of those children have ended up in the sex trade. So all aspects of this. The, the senator I'm running against, Senator Baldwin, to tell you how radical she is, she said we spend too much money on the southern border, but she gave all of our money to a transgender clinic here in Madison that does this without notifying parents. So that's who I'm mm. running against. Look, we got to fight and take our and the, wonderful and, country back. We're losing and, our country. And everyone should know that this race, critically important in Wisconsin, it's within the margin of error in that Marquette poll. Everyone get out there and vote in Wisconsin. If you like the status quo, vote for the incumbent. If you want change, Eric Covde. Eric, thank you so much. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.